We are back with the news out of Washington yesterday where President Trump signed a bill into law classifying animal cruelty as a federal felony. Defense attorney Barry Covert joins us now. So Barry, what does this mean locally for someone charged with animal cruelty? If it in any way affects interstate commerce, now they can be charged in federal court. So if the animals were purchased in interstate commerce, if they've moved in interstate commerce, if that individual was doing it in multiple states, now they can be facing felony charges in federal court and up to seven years of incarceration. So it really expands the prior law that was enacted in 2010, which made it illegal to, to, to distribute videotapes of animal cruelty and what they call crushing, mm -hmm. torturing animals. Now it's expanded to actually committing those acts in and of themselves if there's some impact upon interstate commerce. And the government has been very broad in trying to argue an impact upon interstate commerce. I would imagine that they'll argue that if they were fed with ingredients that traveled in interstate commerce, if they were moved in vehicles built in interstate commerce, that now you're going to be facing a federal felony up to seven years of incarceration. So it doesn't necessarily have to to mean that you took the animal across state lines. No, it can be it means that you somehow used anything that was in interstate commerce to try to feed the animals, to store the animals, to transport the animals, even if you didn't transport them in interstate commerce. There's a lot of arguments now that the federal government will have to try to federalize it criminally, bring you into federal court, which is much more serious than the current charges in state court. Now, if someone was uh, arrested and charged before the law changed, how does that impact them? The, then they wouldn't be uh, permitted to be charged under this. That's ex post facto, so, so they could not bring that under these charges now, under these cases. All righty, very good. Attorney Barry Covert, thanks for joining us.